It's Monday, January 13th, 2020. It's uh, a little after noon and it's minus three Celsius or about 26 Fahrenheit. And as you can see, I won't be doing any hive inspections real soon. <laughs> uh, we have about uh, five centimeters of snow or roughly two inches. This is supposed to keep up for the next couple of days and then it's supposed to get warmer again. So, I'm going to get the snow shovel and clear the driveway and uh, light the fire and stay indoors and stay warm. So I'll be back. Good morning. It is Wednesday, January 15th. Minus 4 Celsius, or about 25 Fahrenheit, and we had a major snowfall last night. You see there's almost a, a foot of snow on the hot tub. It's still early, it's only about 7.30 in the morning, so the video is going to be a little grainy, I think. But my first job this morning is to pull the snow off the uh, greenhouse roof because it's not designed for that much weight. So, I've got my uh, deep wading boots on and I'm going to head off and do that. Maybe I'll uh, have a look inside the uh, rescue hive a little later today. Alright, so we'll be back. Good morning, it's Thursday, January 16th and... Oh, our big snow event seems to be over for the time being. So you can see there's still quite a bit of it out there. So I'm going to uh, take the uh, feeder box off the, the nuke and I'm going to have a look in there and just have a quick look and see what they're doing. Uh, because it was so cold the last two or three days, Heather and I talked about putting something over the entrance outside the window so that the uh, really cold air wouldn't be uh, flowing in through that entrance tube and into the hive to uh, maybe chill off any brood that's in, in there so and I completely forgot but she bless her heart remembered and she went out in the storm and and just threw a towel over the entrance and uh, that should have helped quite a bit so anyway I'm going to get set up here and uh, we'll have a look and see what they're doing. All right, so I've got the feeder box off and I'm taking out the first two frames. That uh, protein powder I put in there, they've actually done quite a good number on it. So I think they're using it. And you can see there's a few checking out the honey on that side of that frame. And there's just a few bees milling around. Once again, they're just milling around on this side of the frame, but it looks like the majority of them are on the frame with the brood. Actually, quite a few more dead bees in the bottom. Sorry, I'm trying to get this to focus. There, you can see eggs there. There's our queen. Hard to tell what, uh, what they've got going on under that little cluster. Let's see if I can just move them over a little bit. So there's a small amount of brood there. So I'm going to um, 
stop the video for a second so I can get a snapshot of what this looks like. There, we got some video of that, so uh, just going to put them back together. I took some snapshots so I could compare from last week to this week to see what the uh, differences were. Oh man, the bottom of that box is really dirty, so hopefully the weather will get uh, nice enough outside soon so that I can take them out of this box and put them in a clean one and uh, give them a fresh home to live in. So, um, that's what it looks like this week. Uh, we'll hope to keep going and uh, we're hoping you're all having a good day and staying indoors, staying warm. All right, we'll talk again soon. Thanks for watching. Bye.